Well, difficult milestone for US, the U.S. this week when it comes to COVID-19. The, the death toll from the pandemic is now past 900,000. But there is still some progress being made currently. New cases are down here in Indiana and across most of the country. John Lawrence has that story. More than 2,000 people are dying from COVID-19 every day on average, according to Johns Hopkins University. Uh, the toll has been horrible and will continue to be horrible for several weeks as deaths lag uh, cases. As for new cases, there are signs of hope in the U.S. as they're down in nearly every state. That's leading some municipalities to consider easing mask mandates. On Friday, Denver, Colorado ended its indoor mask rule altogether. And while health experts are happy with the downward trend in cases. So we're right now dropping rapidly. and We've had all these spikes and we've we've yet to see whether there'll be another surge uh, after this one. So I think it's too premature to call this uh, the beginning of sort of the endemic stage of, of this virus. They're continuing to sound the alarm about the dangers of remaining unvaccinated. The CDC says unvaccinated people are 97 times more likely to die from COVID compared to those who are vaccinated and boosted. I ask, what are you afraid of as far as the vaccine? What is it that you worry about when you see hundreds of millions of doses given in this country? And the safety profile has been extraordinarily safe. I'm John Lawrence reporting.